YouTube fam, welcome back. Thank y'all so much for having my back over the last few days. I appreciate all the well wishes while I've been recovering from this really weird cough I've been getting lately. But here I am, back in full effect. If you're brand new to this channel, my name is Devin on deck. Here I cover fashion and tech, and today we're talking about four legitimate ways to get free clothing when you have little to no money. And this is one of the simplest ways to get free clothing that's actually been around for a long time, but if you're just now getting into fashion and you don't really shop online like that, it might be off your radar altogether. And basically how it works is, if you refer someone, a friend, family member, somebody you know online, and they make a purchase using your code, then you get a certain amount of credits to your account that you can use towards purchasing clothing or shoes. You have like Grace brand, Bonobos, Ministry of Supply that actually has really good quality basics. So if you wanna check out those three different stores, I put links down below in the description for you so you can check out the different programs to see which ones you wanna try out. Easy way to do it, you don't have to spend any money to make it happen. This method is obviously my favorite one on this list because it's the one that I use all the time. I've been literally getting free clothes from brands since like 2013 or 2014 when I had almost no followers. So don't feel like you gotta have a whole bunch of followers on Instagram or YouTube or whatever to make it happen. All you have to do is communicate to a brand the value you bring them, something they may not already have, that they can then exchange for free clothing. So if you're a dope photographer, you take dope photos, it doesn't matter your following. You can provide them content that they can post. If you start a YouTube channel or you're a smaller YouTuber without a lot of budget to wear clothes, who says you have to do lookbooks because other people do lookbooks? I've done like literally two lookbooks on my channel and I almost been on YouTube for two years. Mostly when I do my videos, you notice, I'll just pull pictures from online and just explain different ways and explain different tips without ever having to buy anything. And that's how I saved a lot of money throughout this entire time I've been on YouTube. So if you're a little bit creative, you can do it. And the same principle works for Instagram. If you don't really have any clothing or you don't want to take pictures of yourself, then make a theme page. And what a theme page is, is a page that's built on a theme. You've probably seen these before, the page that's like all food, or a page that's all cars, or a page that is all men's fashion. You have all these pages that have grown to millions of followers without ever having to post themselves. They're just posting pictures they collect that other people take and post. How simple of a process is that? And once you start building a following, then you can reach out to a brand and say, hey, here's my Instagram, here's my YouTube. I'd love to then promote your products on these pages in exchange for the free products. Bada bing, bada boom, no money spent. Now, I don't know why people keep sleeping on this website, but Craigslist is one of the best places to get free stuff in general, okay? We're talking furniture, dishware, shoes, you name it. And when it comes to clothing, people aren't necessarily giving away bad stuff, especially if you're talking like a wealthier, rich neighborhood. And even if you don't live in one, you probably have one somewhere in your surrounding area. So look on Craigslist in the free section and just narrow it down to the rich neighborhoods in your area. And if they're giving away free clothes, they're probably dope, expensive clothing that they don't even care to sell because they don't need to because they're wealthy. You get what I'm saying? So don't sleep on Craigslist. List, go check that out. Thank me later. Now before I get to this final one that I used to actually do all the time in my early 20s to get free clothing guaranteed, this is one video a part of a larger series of affordable fashion videos. I got boots for you, I got affordable jackets, I got how to style cheap clothing, and I'll put all the links down below in the description for you if you want to see more videos like this. And if you like what you see, please give me a sub. I would greatly appreciate that. Now, on to the rest of the video. Now obviously for this one you have to be of working age, but here in America at stores like Vans, you can start there when you're 16. So even if you're in high school, it's no excuse. And in fact, that was the last job that I had before I left the retail industry for tech. And when you first start there, they give you a fresh pair of sneakers and two t-shirts, and the rest of the time you work there, all sneakers are like 50% off for you. So a $50 pair of sneakers, which are like most Vans, are now 25 bucks. And if we're talking like a better market retailer or like a high-end retailer, you're talking like full head-to-toe outfits, you're talking about monthly clothing allowances, sometimes every couple of weeks, depending on where you work. If you need to solve your money problem, you ain't got no money, but you also wanna build your wardrobe, that is the best way on this list to really make it happen. But now that I'm done with this video, I would love to hear you guys 
guys and what you guys think of creative ways to get free clothing. Let me know right now in the comments if you enjoyed this, if this woke up your mind to anything, give your guy a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate that. If you haven't subbed to this channel yet, make that happen. Thank you so much for your time and I will see you on the next one. Peace.